What's up everyone? So today I have a quick video for you. If you're having problems with your Prusa Mini, I suspect it to be um, similar to the other Prusas. But if you cannot flash your firmware to the latest generation, let me show you how to fix that real quick. So say you're trying to flash the latest firmware and the latest firmware's uh, six point whatever, right? And you're all the way down here on 4.3.3. Uh, like I am in order to flash the latest firmware you actually got to go to the older firmware uh, options flash every single one in between in order for you to flash the latest and greatest so let me show you how I did it um, what you do is you just press download this one's uh, I downloaded 4.3.3 .3. now I'm gonna download 4.34 uh, you just press download. Once you download, you go to your locations at where they're at. Okay. Um, let me delete the one that's in there because I just downloaded the 4.33. Uh, so let me delete this one, which is 4.33. I don't need that no more. Go to do downloads, double click it drag that onto the USB drive, right? So now it's on my USB drive, eject it. You might be able to uh, drop them all in there. I'm not sure. I don't want to try it and mess something up, but uh, we're gonna do this way just because I know it's working. So on 4.40, uh, you click this one, you're given another folder. Um, you double click. I had to drag both of these onto the USB drive. There's a document that you could read, of course, but it does tell you that both files need to be dragged and dropped. Both files must be included in the USB drive, okay? So if you're concerned about any of this, uh, make sure you, you read the README text document and that'll basically direct you in the right direction on each one of these uh, downloads. Now what you're gonna do is just plug it in like that. As you can see, it wants to go to the print screen, but we don't care, uh, or print options. And you just hold this, press it, uh, press it and hold it for maybe a half second or whatever, just to make sure it resets. And then hold this knob down for a few seconds. I think it's like three seconds and then uh, there you go it's flashing to the next one if you skip all the ones in between it will not flash at all and you'll think your uh, printer's messed up but that's the way to flash it if you're way out of date like I was so one thing I noticed with the um, flashing that has the double um, files it does take a little longer to flash uh, and it's gonna prompt you to uh, select flash, so it's not gonna happen automatic. So this is what the flash screen looks like. Um, so you could skip or you could flash. Uh, if you don't do anything, it'll basically do it for you, but I'll select flash on this, this update. So if you're hooked up to the network, um, it looks like Prusa allows you to just drag and drop uh, the BBF file from here straight to your network. Uh, and have it update the firmware that way instead of running this USB back and forth from your computer to the printer uh, to get them all updated so you can just drag and drop it. So that's going to complete today's video. I hope it helped you uh, in getting your firmware up to date and if someone knows of the instruction location I, I wasn't able to find it currently uh, definitely um, leave that in the comments for other people to find if this video is still confusing. Thanks for watching. I'll see y'all in the next one.